Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Delhi Tarot and these are your money career reading for the sun, moon and the rising sign of cancer. Please keep in mind that this is your general reading for the month of November 2023. It's a group general reading. So please pick it up what resonates with you. Please leave the rest for others. And few people are inquiring about the 2024 reading. In every video I have mentioned that you can book your 2024 reading. Every personal private reading is a paid process. Please connect with me with that understanding. I really appreciate that. <clears throat> Excuse me. And if you really like what I do on the channel, please do like, subscribe the channel and put on the notifications. Angels and spirits. Messages for my dear cancer people out there. And tomorrow I shall be doing quick weekly readings also. Okay, in your Moonology Cancer, you have half faith in your dreams. You and your loved ones are safe. And then you have the end of tough cycle approaches. Now, if I see your Moonology reading, it's a very impressive reading. Now, there is a change coming into your professional life. And what I feel that the change uh, will be in a sort that the struggle or something which needs resolution will come to an end. But in order to get what you want, your goal, your set target, that is going to take little workout. That is going to take little time. You need to prepare for it. You need to make a strategy. And for that, the angels are telling that you need to have faith into your dreams. So once you cross the hurdle, once you cross the major challenges, once you feel that, oh, the struggle has now ended, post that you can prepare for that new journey because that is going to take three to four months of time. And till that time, you need to hold on your trust and faith. And you need to keep up your visualization, your manifestation, your dreams very much alive. Because for a goal or a wish fulfillment, that is going to take little time. And it is important that you do not leave your hope in between. Because first you have to complete this cycle of, you know, the tussle which is going on or the delay which is going on in some of your important things. And then you also have your card, you and your loved ones are safe. So even if you are trying to take some calculated risk professionally, please know that whatever you are planning, whatever you are strategizing or whatever initiative you are going to take, everything is going to be absolutely safe for you to experiment, absolutely safe for you to explore and things will come on right track. You will choose the right direction for sure. My angels are telling me that from, you know, you are very, very sensible. You are very, very mature with your decisions so far. It is just that you need something very particular. And for that, there is little time gap because what you need is not nurtured right at the moment. It will take little more time until that time. Just have your patience, just have your faith, you know, and your trust on divine that whatever you are manifesting or whatever you have wished in the past, you will get it for sure. Now, let us see what messages do we have from your animal spirit message guide. You have the stack spirit, which says take the lead. You need to take the lead wherever you feel you need to bring change into your professional life or into your money, career, financial situation. It's you who has to take the complete responsibility and you need to reclaim your power, your boldness, your courage to adopt some, some challenge which you will be very competent. Now, what I am getting the message from this card is that you are, you are even sure of your skills and competencies, but every time you are thinking about you know, the results, the outcome more and the more you will be thinking only about the result and outcome, you will be actually questioning or challenging yourself more. So you need to reclaim your power. You need to trust on your strength that whatever you want, whatever you want to achieve, you will 100% achieve that for sure. 
and your other animal spirit message guide says it's time for you to collaborate which is a clear indication that be open for partnership be open for joint venture if off late you are thinking about joining hands with somebody you are thinking it's on your mind it's a yes card for all those questions and it's a yes card that it is not the time for you to work independently uh, you know in individual capacity rather it is the time of collaboration it's time for you to be in association with some organization or if you want to start something of your own the partnership the joint venture working with a partner will suit you more partnership will bring better money better opportunities for yourself so look forward to partnerships in the month of november for sure now if i see your goddess oracle card you have a card of medicine woman oh my goodness you are blessed with you know such beautiful dietary and i'm so happy that today whichever reading i am doing goddess lakshmi is showing her presence and i feel that this presence is always for you know not just for your subscribers my subscribers here or i did leo reading i did sagittarius reading and now i am doing cancer reading this is for the third time goddess lakshmi is showing her presence to all of us and to me especially and this is the bright future which is a confirmation to all my people out there and it says stop worrying as everything is going to be fine so allow all your anxiety your stress your fears your doubts to let go because all your materialistic needs your desires your wants will be well taken care of for sure you also have a card of medicine woman which says you are a channel for divine healing power this means any profession any service related to humanity mankind helping people you know not just medicine but therapy healing services that kind of profession is really going to be very very helpful for your own upliftment also and then you have goddess saraswati into your reading express yourself through creativity and activities now for any money career finance reading in the goddess oracle deck these two are two of the main most powerful card along with goddess kali we have three goddesses card in this deck and out of three you have got two goddesses blessings into your reading and it really means something big cancer people trust me that means you have big dietary support you know dietary support in your reading goddess lakshmi along with goddess saraswati means if you have anything any idea which is creative which is innovative something you want to start of your own trust me the both the dietaries are available are giving you blessings that this is the right time for you to start that creative innovation it's a yes sign it's a yes indication to all those people who were waiting for the right time to start something of their own and yes that creation will lead to great prosperity and growth for sure because of the presence of goddess lakshmi out there it's a fabulous reading and a very blessed reading uh cancer people now let us see what messages do we have from tarot and i'm going to pull out you know uh three cards for your first uh two weeks of i have modulated the reading little all the reading i'm doing the oracle card reading and tarot card reading to give you complete insights i want you to see your cards let us see what messages do we have for your november tarot card reading money career let us see the first two weeks we have the major arcana the moon and then we have the five of swords and then we have the justice oh my goodness so you have got two major arcana card in the first two weeks of november now there will be a con some confusion some illusion some indecisiveness and the moon card says that it is the time not to 
uh, trust 100% completely anyone. It is the time when you might witness betrayal from someone who is known to you, who is close to you or someone with whom you are expecting so much and the person is not that trustworthy and you are relying too much on some resource which is not honest with you. And you need, some, you need to be very careful about this because when you have a moon card, your own people go against you, your own people fall into conspiracy and your own people stab at your back. You need to be very careful that you're not sharing your plans, your important sensitive information just like that with anyone and you are being mindful of what you are sharing and you are retaining the important information only with yourself. So you have to be very careful about that. And then you also have a major arcana card, the justice, which says that in the first two weeks, let me tell you, the first two weeks are going to be very difficult. And you will see animism, jealousy, enviousness around you in a, in a huge quantity. And this will lead to you defending yourself, you protecting yourself. But the situation is very much into control. You also have a card of justice which says this is some karmic lesson which you will be going through. So for first two weeks, please know that you are maintaining your calm and peace. I do expect a little turmoil and that turmoil is going to be your karmic lesson. And karmic lesson means some give and take people who come into your life we feel they are taking revenge. We feel they are, ha they are having differences with us. But they are in our life for our own karmic accounts closure and karmic accounts balancing. Allow that to happen. But be careful with your work, with your papers, with your, with your numbers, with your signatures with your checkbooks with your documents sensitive documents your emails your password do not trust anybody blindly just like that in the first two weeks of november especially but then when when you feel that oh i trusted this person so much or why this person is behaving like this with me in my workplace or in my accounts in my in my you know money finances areas it is your karmic relationship. This is the, the card of justice says it all. It's a karmic relationship which is there in your life to make you learn that karmic lesson and to close that particular account. You know, it's a very important aspect. I explain it more to people while they have a personal reading, but this really means a lot if this combination is coming into your reading. This is a very unusual kind of tarot combination which is coming into your reading, Cancer. Okay, now let us see what messages do we have in the last two weeks of November. You have got eight of pentacles. You have got the major arcana again, the hanging man. And then you have the devil. Oh my goodness. So out of six cards, you have got four major arcana cards, which means expect that there will be major, there will be massive changes coming into your professional life for sure. Now the devil says that you need to get back to your focus because something is making you, dragging you away from being goal oriented, target oriented. This could be some habit. This could be some addiction. You need to be careful about that. You know what is making you, taking you away from work. And you need to recognize that and you need to let it go. Till the time you will be stick to that habit, you will be moving away from your goal. And then a personal issue reaches resolution, but with little adjustment compromise. And the card of eight of pentacles says that it's time for you to upskill, upgrade, your skills and competencies whenever you feel you're getting time you're getting opportunity to learn but this also says that few of you will have additional responsibility but that additional responsibility the good news here is it will come with better money more money so if you are given more additional work 
प्लीज नो यूल गेट एडिशनल इंसेंटिव बोनस इज एज वेल सो येस इफ आई सी द टू पार्ट और इफ आई सी द होल मंथ इन टू पार्ट योर फर्स्ट टू वीक्स आर गोइंग टू बी चैलेंजिंग एंड योर रिमेनिंग पार्ट ऑफ द मंथ ऑफ नवम्बर इज गोइंग टू बी लिटिल रीगेनिंग और लिटिल रिकवरी मोड दिस इज गोइंग टू बी नाउ लेट अस सी वॉट मनी मैजिक डेक मैसेज डू वी हैव फॉर यू एंड वी डू हैव अ कार्ड ऑफ फ्लिक्स फिक्टेशियस इट्स एज पावर सिंबल टू क्रिएट लकी events for you now there will be some sign symbol indication it's time for you to be careful and watchful if you are getting any indication from people from your own thought feeling or somebody known unknown giving any clue to you the angels are saying for every event you will get the clue for every event they will the angels are going to send the signs to you it is up to you that whether you are catching these the those signs and symbols or those indications but you will have for sure indications from the angels side now let us see what messages do we have from angel of abundance for you and it says exercise to increase your energy and manifestation ability and the message is the key to manifesting quickly is to have very high energy levels and the easiest way to increase them is through physical exercise choose a fun and meaningful activity so that you will look forward to exercising and it becomes its own reward for you now this is a beautiful message now let us see what final messages do we have from your divine door we have walk about it says you discover your path in sacred walk about the trees are your people the earth is your tribe in indigenous lessons you will find the will to survive and your other message card is begin here this is an indication for you to start something new this could be a new contract job or a project do not fear what travel what journey is going to bring my dear the moment is yours begin now here this is an indication for a travel and journey which says that do not get afraid be open to travel the last message is three eyed raven it says as sunrise hits upon the dew a messenger's raven crawls out with the news this means prepare for the unexpected you know suddenly a beautiful blessing a sudden revelation of something is going to bring huge happiness into your professional life it's a very beautiful reading cancer do let me know how you resonated with your reading i will see you next time very soon be blessed